The study abroad title is called Medicine, Microbiology and Health and it's run through the Department of Microbiology and Cell Science. The emphasis, as the title says, is medicine, where you know they learn about health systems, healthcare, um, pharmaceuticals, and naturopathy to some extent. Microbiology, they learn about um, the, a lot of the history of microbiology, which happened in Europe, and also the applications in real life. And health is the way of living in Europe, which includes the food, exercise, um, spas, and lots of other ways of living that's different from the United States. We started this year in Amsterdam, in Holland, and because we started in Amsterdam because it has the only and the first microbiology museum, the Microbia, and so I wanted to show that to the students. We then went to Delft, where Leeuwenhoek was uh, lived and where he discovered microbes. Um, we then went to Germany, went to uh, Heidelberg, France, Strasbourg, and some other places, and then ventured into Switzerland. I uh, went to Basel, a small town called Fluli, and then we ended up in Geneva. And it was a very nice overview of the Central European beauty of what, what the country has to offer. Mm -hmm. I think it's a pretty unique trip because it's not just, you know, big cities or staying in one place. Uh, it's really more, you know, off the beaten path because you go to lots of smaller places, very traditional places where they meet a lot of local places, people. Um, I think in terms of learning of microbiology, medicine and health, they probably learn something, several different things every single day because it's very intertwined, whether it's a museum, whether it is the food they eat and taste, and I can see that it's many times it doesn't have more um, as of this additives, they're very conscious about GMOs, um, they use a lot of fresh foods, as much, much less fast food is what we've eaten. So I think every day they encounter pieces of medicine, microbiology and health besides the big pieces like you know visiting the World Health Organization or visiting um, Hoffman La Roche pharmaceutical company where it's sort of obvious what they learn but uh, it's ingrained in everyday life um, and emphasized in different visits we do. It was a shock to the system for most of them uh, many of them have not traveled much at all some have never traveled outside the states or one hasn't even ever been on a plane and so for them it was a totally new experience. Um, the students were very different, their background was very different, the expectation was different, their you know, moral systems, and you know, there was just a lot of differences, but they were thrown together and lived together for two and a half weeks. And the bonds they formed very quickly is pretty unique. And I think when you take students with a diverse background into an even newer environment, the bonding happens very quickly mm -hmm. and it was fun to watch you know watch really different people get on well and do things together and share that experience which they can't share with other people at home because they weren't there.